So if you're struggling to find enough time to get everything done and you're overwhelmed by a bunch of different duties and things, in this video, I'm gonna share eight of my top life hacks that get me a bunch of more of my time back and make things simpler so that I can put my time towards things like growing my business or taking care of my health and spending time with my family. So without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, this is our coffee station and buying an espresso machine like this has saved us so much time and money. I think this was like 600 bucks or something but if you multiply the cost of a latte at a coffee shop by however many of those you buy per year, I don't know, but for me, I found that I was gonna break even on this in probably about one year, because that's how much I spent at coffee shops. Um, you do have to get a grinder, or they make one that has a grinder attached, but being able to make delicious lattes or whatever your drink of choice is at your own house versus having to go out and get it, will save you a bunch of time. And ultimately this is going to pay for itself um, once you've made enough lattes. I make smoothies, uh, I drink these every morning, um, but I make them the night before. So in the morning, I don't have to get out all this shit and go blend and then clean up and all that. I actually make smoothies for my wife and daughter as well, all in the morning and we wake up and we have our latte machine like I showed you, and then we have smoothies ready to go, and that makes things way easier. Also, we use the same container for just about everything. This size of container is awesome for going in the fridge, these little glass containers. And so, you know, we used to have a thousand different Tupperwares everywhere, um, but instead, we just have a bunch of these. And then it's easy to organize and stack everything and you don't have to uh, deal with trying to match a thousand different types of containers up. Next is this Nest thermostat. These things are awesome. Uh, you can program them to be at whatever temperatures you want and create a schedule for your house. Uh, we have one here and then we have one on the upstairs as well. And I have schedules programmed for both of them so I don't ever really have to go and adjust the heat or air, it's all taken care of ahead of time. Time to stop going to the grocery store, guys. I know you're gonna be sad because you can't pick out your own head of kale or whatever, but uh, we just got our groceries delivered. I already put them away. These are all the bags, but once a week, you know, we just go on, bloop, bloop, bloop. It takes like 10 minutes, punch a few buttons in. It remembers all your old orders. Uh, we use Amazon Fresh or whatever because it comes from Whole Foods, but there's plenty of other versions like Instacart and not going to the grocery store and shopping for all this shit probably saves us at least two hours per week. Everyone worries about wanting to pick out their own produce. I can tell you the amount of times where we've gotten like something bad is like probably less than 10 in years of doing this and you always get a refund. Yes, it sucks that you don't have that one thing, but is that really worth all the different hours that you're gonna spend driving and shopping yourself? Okay, you know how businesses have inventories of things like a storage or a backup? Um, well, we do too for our house, like Swiffer pads or these Shark uh, Vac mops. Uh, Dude wipes, my favorite, right? The lotion that we use, nail files, uh, hydrogen peroxide, flosser sticks, rinse aid for the dishwasher. Uh, this is like countertop cleaner, dish soap, um, there's scrubber pads back there. There's vanilla for the coffee. Uh, whatever we use, the dryer sheets up here, whatever we use on a consistent basis, I order a storage of it because it doesn't make sense to me to run out of stuff and be like, oh, I gotta run to the store. I'd rather have like a small inventory of it. <clears throat> and so I do that for like our vitamins too. Like if you look in here, um, I have like storages of all the different vitamins that we buy. Um, but I think like for anything that you're going to use, like you're, you're going to keep having to buy trash bags, right? So get on Amazon and subscribe to your favorite type of trash bag on the frequency that you need them. Like if you use uh, 15 trash bags a month and they have a 45 count box, then you can subscribe to that uh, within every three months frequency. 
And then every three months when you need trash bags, they will arrive at your door. And so you can buy a couple of boxes up front to get a little bit of a storage like I have, and then set that every three month thing to happen. So you're always getting refreshed with whatever you need. Uh, I went through our whole house and put everything that we buy on subscribe and save. So I don't have to think about it anymore. And that has helped me tremendously. Okay, another thing that helps me is wearing only one type of sock. So I used to wear uh, these stance socks, but they I found that they wear out pretty fast on the bottoms. So I'm switching over to these black Under Armour socks. I like black socks because they look good and they don't show dirt. Uh, but when you're doing laundry and you don't want to do like have to match up all that, or if you don't want to decide what pair to wear, um, you know, Steve Jobs is famous for only wearing black turtlenecks. I'm not that crazy. I've got a few. I don't have a the greatest wardrobe, right? It's kind of plain. Um, but at least I can choose between some color. Uh, but socks, I think it makes sense to just pick one and buy a ton of them and throw all your other socks away. Okay, my wife's going to kill me for this because the beds are not made and looking pretty. But I wanted to show you uh, this thing. This is not really a life hack, but it's about how to get better sleep, which kind of underpins all of our success, right? And happiness in life. This is called a bed jet. And what it does is it plugs into the wall. It pumps air up this pipe into a sheet. Uh, and the sheet has a top and a bottom. So they're sewn together. So it's like a pocket. And then you use this remote and you turn it on and it has heat and cool. So you can heat your bed in the winter, which is amazing, uh, right when you're getting in. Uh, and then you can cool it as well. And I'm just turning it up to the maximum so you can see uh, what it's like. I don't sleep with it on the maximum, it would be too cold. But you can see it is filling that sheet up with air. And uh, my wife has one over here too. And basically um, with the bed jet, you have total control over the temperature of your bed. So then the big comforter goes over top and that air is flowing through that sheet all the way up to you. Um, but it's not blowing directly on your body because it's going in between the two sheets. So it's kind of seeping out. Um, but like I used to always have trouble either being too hot, usually too hot in sleeping, but I wanted the heavy blanket because it's like soothing to feel it on you. And uh, with this thing, uh, you have total control over the temperature of your bed um, and so it's impossible to be too hot, no matter how many blankets you have. Um, and so this has definitely helped me sleep probably at like 30% better than I ever was before. And you can think about the compound effect that has had on helping me in every other area of life. So if these eight life hacks are going to help you guys save time, make things more streamlined and easier so that you can crush your goals in 2022. If you found this video valuable, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss the next one and comment down below and let me know some of your favorite life hacks too. And thanks for watching. I will see you in the next one.